God says this person is marked for dead. God says this person is marked for dead. Please watch to the end to get what God is saying in this video. This is prayers and counseling with Damaris. Are you seeing me if you're very first time? You're welcome. I love you so much. God bless you mightily in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let us pray. Father, we thank you for this awesome word. We give you glory. We receive this word with gladness. We love you, Abba Father. May we thank you for your love that surpasses ours. In the name of Jesus. Amen. God says, this person in your life who is critically ill is marked for dead. And the only reason why they are alive is because you are close to them. Because you are still with them. Now the enemy has planted grudge in your heart. You are angry with this person. Yes, this person offended you. But child of God, they need you now more than ever. They have been marked for dead. And the reason why they are not dead is because you are there. Because you are interceding and praying for them. Because your spirit is strong. And that is why they are not yet dead. The moment you live their lives, the moment your anger causes you to live their lives and abandon them, they will die. Because they have been marked. You think this sickness is an ordinary one, but it's not ordinary. It is a spiritual attack. You are, they are alive because you are dead close to them. Please, stand by them. Pray for them more. Pray for them more. When you resist the devil, he will flee. He will get tired and he will flee away. In the name of Jesus, amen. Now the Lord bless you, the Lord keep you, the Lord cause his face to shine upon you, the Lord be gracious to you, the Lord give you peace, the shalom of the Lord, nothing missing, nothing broken, I love you child of God, but Jesus loves you and I even more, honey, and that is what matters, amen.